The Utah Department of Transportation partnered with the Utah Transit Authority to have this autonomous shuttle showcased in, in Utah for people to experience what it's like to have a fully autonomous vehicle. We look at this as another opportunity for us to help the nation, help the world of transportation as a whole uh, achieve greater things in the field. We've had the shuttle here in Utah now for over a year, and that's allowed us to move it around the state to several different venues, several different uh, sites that have different operating characteristics. And that gave the opportunity for those folks that are in those areas to experience what that shuttle might do for them as a, as a transit option. And that also gave us a chance to learn from them uh, how they feel about the safety of the vehicle. We're excited about the technology, and through the last several months of working with UTA and UDOT in this pilot program, we've learned a lot about the safety measures that are in place and it's super excited about those. Um, we're excited to implement something on a more permanent basis. We wanted to give people who just experienced the shuttle a chance to tell us what they thought about it. So after they rode, we had um, ambassadors stationed uh, right at the shuttle stops and they would interview them and survey about their perceptions and how they thought this would complement transit and transportation in the future. I feel like in, it's a good idea. I had a, it was an exciting experience to try it out for the first time. Some pros are that it's extremely safe and I feel like it's a handicap accessible. I feel like that um, it can be used for a lot of different things. That's also a pro. I think we find the use of the autonomous vehicle as really an option for people to be able to do that first mile, last mile over to the um, cord bus network, our track stations, our front runner stations, really that ability to have a mobility option to be able to get to our transit network. Filling a need, especially in our more urbanized area here in St. George and in our communities. I feel like we're just getting started in exploring self-driving vehicles. So this is the beginning of what the future holds for transportation. We basically have the Model T of self-driving vehicles and we're excited about the future.